Okay, so I have a bunch. Hey guys, what's good? What's popping? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. I hope you all are doing amazing. If you're new to my YouTube channel, I hope you are already subscribed or. If you haven't already subscribed to my channel yet then please consider subscribing and also pressing the bell icon right beside it so you get notified every single time I post a new video. But in today's video I have something really exciting for you guys. I know you all must have already been aware of it by seeing the title. So I have a bunch of stuff here that I got from Nike. So I just cannot wait to show you guys. So yeah, the damage is done. I burnt my pocket. But anyways, I know for a fact that I'm going to use all of these products for sure. So, we've got Huda Beauty, we've got Too Faced, L'Oreal and all that good stuff. And I cannot wait to show you guys. So, let's get into the video now. So, first things first, let me show you a product that I got which you are not supposed to go out without wearing it. That is sunscreen. So, I got the new uh, L'Oreal Paris UV Perfect Super Aqua Essence Sunscreen. So now this consists of SPF 50 and has a mexoral filter which is a great ingredient to protect your skin from the UVA and UVB rays. I think this is somewhere in between a physical sunscreen and a chemical sunscreen. Now let me tell you the difference between a physical sunscreen and a chemical sunscreen. Physical sunscreens are more on the thicker side that means it is not very ideally suitable for oily and acne prone skin tones. Whereas comparatively with chemical sunscreens are more on the thinner consistency. So you know it's not really thick when compared to the physical sunscreen. So I've used this sunscreen today morning and I really liked it because it doesn't leave a white cast on your skin which is a really good thing because we all tend to avoid sunscreens because of the white cast that it will leave and it really doesn't look good on pictures. I think this one is really different from the other sunscreens and, and I'm really looking forward to using this every single day. And also please do not forget to wear your sunscreens every day because be it summers, be it winter, be it any day, if, even if it's sunny or not, you have to wear a sun protection which has a good SPF. I will leave all the links and uh, prizes below in the description box so you guys make sure that you check it all right the next product is also from l'oreal so this is a liquid highlighter that i picked up and this is in the shade loving peach i'm gonna swatch it for you guys i've been into liquid highlighters lately because they look so natural i don't know if you guys can see i don't know if the camera is gonna catch it and that is how it looks like it's a very nice a golden sort of a peachy kind of a highlighter. So this is how it looks like after blending it. And this is gonna look absolutely natural on your skin um, and I cannot wait to try this. Next product is again from L'Oreal. This is the L'Oreal blush that they've launched recently. Packaging looks so classy and premium and uh, this is in the shade Play With Me. And it's got a really beautiful okay you have a brush with it which of course i won't be using I think, oh wait i think you can use it for your nose contour i guess it's gonna be good so yeah i'm not throwing that okay so we have um this blush which is a very nice peachy sort of an everyday kind of a brush a uh, brush lol blush i know for a fact that i'm gonna wear this every single day so that's the reason i picked it up it also comes with a mirror is very handy again okay so the next product is from guess guess it's from Huda Beauty yes so I picked up these two matte and melt uh, eyeshadows I was eyeing on these eyeshadows since forever now and I finally got my hands on these and this is in the shade minted and dinero and the next one is in the shade silk bomber and bubblegum Okay, so the next product is a restock. Now, if you've been following me on Instagram, you know that I love the Super Light Gel Oil Free Moisturizer from Pons. It's one of their best sellers and also it's one of their best product as well. It's got this really good, very nice light consistency to it, which just emulsifies into your skin. I think this smells like um, ocean, like fresh water ocean. Okay, so it, it smells like ocean for some reason for me, but 
it's a good product. If you are an oily skin type and looking for a good affordable moisturizer, this is what you need to get. Okay, so the next product is also related to skincare. I mean, this is not a product, but uh, so next step, I picked up this jade roller. Now, I have been eyeing on jade rollers since forever now, and I finally thought I should give them a shot. So, I picked up this. So, this is used to reduce the inflammation and puffiness under your eyes, and also regulate your blood circulation, which is good. So, I think you're supposed to use this while you do your skincare routine. So this is for like your jawline and your face and the smaller size for your under eye area. Really excited to see how this works for me. So next up I picked up this new launch by Benefit Cosmetics. New addition to their lip tints. It's called Love Tint. It doesn't look like a warm tone red shade but it looks so pretty and really natural i haven't tried it on my foundation i always like applying tints on top of my moisturizer because you know they blend in really well they give you that really natural sort of a flush on your cheeks which is great all right so for the next product i picked up the rimmel match perfect foundation i'm really bad when it comes to picking up foundation online so i got this from nika so i don't know i mean i should still see if this matched my skin tone i actually got it for reviewing it for you guys so yeah i got it in the shade 303 true new i'll do a separate review and separate dedicated video on this so stay tuned for that last but not the least that is the two faced diamond light highlighter oh my god you guys i was dying to get my hands on this highlighter not that i don't have highlighters but this is a masterpiece get this really cute packaging and it comes in this really pretty fancy packaging which opens up like a ring and there you go look at the highlighter dang girl this looks so good i don't know if the camera is able to like do justice to the highlighter but it looks so good guys this is my second product from too faced i actually have their uh, dark chocolate sole bronzer and that is one of the cult favorite product that I own. And I think we are pretty much done with the haul. So that's it for today's video guys. I hope you all enjoyed watching the Nika haul. If you did then you guys know the drill. Please don't forget to like, share and subscribe to my channel. It would mean so much to me. I'll see you guys in my next video.